is a Tidal Energy developer. They design, they oversee the manufacture through the build to the point of getting them ready to go to the dockside, ready for deployment at sea. It's not just about the technology, it's also about being able to provide solutions right across the system, from the turbine all the way to the grid to the end user. The energy industry today is still very much dominated by fossil fuels. Although in this country we have a relatively good energy mix, there's still a lot of work that can be done. Tidal energy is entirely predictable. We know exactly how much energy we're going to get from the tide at any point of time now or in the future. The AR1500 is a 1.5 megawatt tidal turbine. Similar to a wind turbine, it has three blades and it yaws into the tide. There are a number of elements that make the AR1500 turbine unique from its competitors. One of these is the connection management system. The connection management system is what connects the turbine to the subsea cable that will export the power to the grid. Traditionally, the connection management system would use what we call dry mate connectors, which need to be engaged when they're not submerged. The AR1500 uses wet mate connectors, which massively simplifies the actual operation of installing the turbine. Since we can drop the turbine from a crane on the deck of a, a DP vessel directly onto an awaiting foundation structure. And this means that we can install and recover turbines in, in 30 minute periods, which minimizes the duration that we spend offshore, which keeps the cost down, which keeps the risk down. With anything to do with the, the tidal side of things, it's it's very surgical. It's obviously got to go subsea for a minimum of six years, so it's down there a long time. So whatever you do, you, you need to make sure that you're doing it correctly, that you're following your procedures, and that you're producing a, a high quality product at the end. We have a very thorough quality control system that checks over every single detail that we implement. So every single subsystem, every component undergoes a series of checks and tests. We have to check the torque on every single bolt. We check the ceiling on, on every single mating face. And every wire needs to be checked to ensure that we have a good electrical connection. Achieving that, that level of precision is vital to achieving a successful machine. With Tidal Energy, we have a great opportunity to make a real positive impact on the environment. Not only are our turbines able to generate carbon-free power, but also they don't have any visual impact on the environment. So areas of natural beauty that are important to the local residents aren't affected. The majority of the monitoring equipment associated with the AR1500 is there to understand how marine mammals um, behave in the vicinity of tidal turbines. And we are so far through all our projects proving to be incredibly environmentally friendly and therefore finding a place in the world for when there is no exhaustible energy sources remaining. The tidal industry was born out of the passion of a few individuals truly believing that they had a great idea. And now today we've got a fantastic team which has grown and all of those people carry that same mindset. Passion is what drives us forward and we work together to tackle all the challenges that we face. We're working on a world leading project. It's hugely important for us personally, for the company, for the industry and indeed for the United Kingdom. Tidal Energy ticks all the boxes for the astute investor. It is environmentally friendly. It's ultimately the most predictable form of renewable energy and the cost targets we set for ourselves are achievable. The Atlantis mission statement is to provide renewable energy to the world. The success of the AR1500 represents a major milestone in achieving that.